Hey everybody, Dark Jungle Link here, back from Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. Can you guess where I am? I'm in the Warden's house. Why? Because I forgot to get this, even though I said forever ago I was going to get it. None of my Pokemon know strength. How embarrassing. And I know exactly who's going to learn strength, because there's only one, one Pokemon I can think of to use it. And they're not able to. Good. Very good. Well, that's fine. I'll come back for it. Because while I was off screen, I caught 50 different kinds of Pokemon. Well, actually I caught a few more because I already had some. But you know what? I don't care. Let's go get that thing from Professor Oaksade. I think he's right up here. Hi, remember me? I want a Professor Oak Saints. If your Pokedex has complete data or 50 species, I'm supposed to give you a reward. Professor can trust me with the experience share for you. So, DYL, let me ask you. Have you gathered at least 50 kinds of Pokemon? Yes. Great! You have caught or owned 50 kinds of Pokemon. Congratulations, here you go. Do I receive blah, 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 blah. So, basically, now... I can give this to my Pokemon and I don't have to keep switching out. Which is like the best thing ever. I'm not sure where exactly it goes in this game though because it's a key item in other games so. But yeah, it's a hold item for your Pokemon and I'm going to give it to my... I'm going to give it to my weakest member of my party which is... Uh, Jack. Also, a little grinding happened off screen, and incidentally, because I was trying to catch some low level Pokemon and they would all keep fainting, and it was annoying. So, continuing on, we're going to. La di da di da. La di da di da di. La di da 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 da. Uh, we're gonna go in here. Because I think there's an Oak Sade in here, too. I was wrong. There's Oak Sades all over the place. I just can't remember where they are. The only important one, though, is the one that gives you the EXP share because, you know, experience is important. So I know this isn't really important to show, but I'm going to anyway. These are the Pokemon that I caught off screen. I'm going to see if any of them had items on them, too. Like this Snorlax has a Chesto Berry. This Jigglypuff has an Oran Berry. Which I will take that. Um. Yeah, these are just all the kinds of Pokemon I caught so far all off screen. I even managed to get some good Pokemon too, like a Scyther. I have two Scythers apparently. Oh, wait, never mind. That was silly of me. But, yeah. None of them had any items. I ran into a whole bunch of chances, which I hoped to, you know, at least get one. Because if there's a chancy, there's a chance you'll get a lucky egg. And a lucky egg is an item that if you, if you give it to a Pokemon, it gets more experience when it's in battle. So... It's really good. I'm gonna put notch out chop right here for a few seconds. This is gonna be a huge pain in the butt later, but I'll have to deal with that another time. Because I only want this right now. This better be worth it. I forgot to teach it strength. I'm doing so good this episode, guys. Look at me go. I'm just... I'm on a roll. A roll of messing up. So, I don't care what moves does this thing even have. Low kick, leer, focus energy, karate chop. I will get rid of leer. Just in case for some reason I decide to use a machop. I would not do that though. Not that Machop's bad or anything. I mean, I already have my full team. 
There's no reason to use Machop. So, strength. Boom. Rare candy. It's good enough for me. So while I'm on a little spree of getting some items, and it's not going to be long, I promise. It's only going to be this item and one more. When I was running around collecting Pokemons, I saw an item that I decided, hey, I want that. Because one, I don't know what it is, and two, I made such a big deal out of it like a few episodes ago that I'm just... I'm just gonna go check it out. I wish actions in this game were faster though. So we're gonna fly to Lavender Town. And we're gonna go down here. Um, I'm gonna see if there's an oak state in here. No. Oh, this is where I got returned. Cool. I remember when that happened. Uh, let's see. Right there. That, no, I don't want you. Yes, the item that distracted me a few episodes ago. I want it. Skill swap. That was not worth my time and effort. I wonder if there's any item. Nah. There will be enough time for item stopping in the future. Look at all this map we've covered so far. There's literally only two areas left. Two areas we have not been to yet. And we got six badges, so... I'm super excited, and I'm going to put... Karen in front because we have trainers to fight I have to exercise and warm up before going out for a swim yeah it probably helps I guess but whatever so these things are pretty high level not as high level as me or Koga really but they're still pretty threatening. Unless you have electric type, then they're not. And this one has a shelter. Shelter is a shell type Pokemon. I don't know if I talked about it yet, but it's part water, part ice. It's a really good Pokemon to have, I would say. But not when someone has an electric type. Wait, slow down, you'll have a heart attack. Um, I'm not going to start singing a certain song because, one, I don't like that song, and two, it's annoying, so, no. Um. So what I've decided to do, I've decided on what I'm gonna do with Karen. She's just going to remain a Pikachu. I know it's kind of stupid, and I know, you know, Raichu's a stronger version. But I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep her as a Pikachu, just because I feel like, just, just because I want to. And it's my Let's Play, so I shall. That came out worse than what it meant to sound like but that's cool uh I mean unless someone has a reason has a good reason for me not to or a good reason for me to evolve besides the fact that it's stronger like if Pikachu will or if Raichu can learn a move that only Raichu can learn that's really good I would kinda want to go out in the water but okay I look at the sea to forget all the bad things that had happened, or that happened. Well, that's nice. The sea is pretty calming. But yeah, this, 
this water, like, this whole part in general, I, I don't like this part. Because it's like, water levels and video games are not my favorite thing. And this is basically like the water level of Pokemon. Because you like have to sail across the sea with your Pokemon. But it's not as bad as in uh, The Legend of Zelda Wind Waker. Because in that game the sailing is slow and it's boring and there's like nothing to there's nothing to uh, it's just a lot of emptiness so maybe I should have stocked up on some repels but if I did that then you know Karen wouldn't get a good training session and that's probably what I would do if I wasn't if I wasn't planning on training but for the sake of not having to stop to grind I'm just going to fight on screen or if I have to I'll just or if the or if there's too many encounters I'll just cut them out doesn't really matter of course Thunderbolt's already running out of PP so hopefully I have some ethers I'll probably check that here after this battle. Also, this is Sea King, the evolved form of Goldeen. I, I, I destroyed it, but... Uh, sea King is actually a really good water type Pokemon. I remember I used it when I was playing Pokemon Sapphire. It was definitely one of my favorites. It's definitely one of my favorite Pokemon. Uh, oh, Elixir. Well, I, I have one elixir. Wait, what's an ether then? Well, now I'm just confused. Then what does elixir do? Restores the PP of all moves. Okay, I see. Well, that's fine then. I got some stuff to get me through the sea level. What's in here? Tentacool! Level 5. That is not... Level 5s are not worth my time. What's beyond the horizon? Uh... Stuff. Things and stuff. I can already tell this is going to be a battle-heavy episode. <laughs> But I guess the only way to make the ocean less boring is by having a whole bunch of people on it or else you'll just be sailing for a long time and you'll have no landmarks to go off of or anything, so whatever. At least the Pokemon aren't all level 5. <laughs> like why are there even level 5s out here? Like you can't even get here when you have a level 5. So the fact that there are level 5s here just show that, I, I'm not sure exactly what it shows, but it's just, why? You'd think the Pokemon out here would be a lot stronger or something. But whatever. I do kind of wish the SSN would come back though, so I could just ride the SSN to. Uh, wait, what's uh, what's the next place again? Cinnabar, Cinnabar Island. That would be awesome, and I think he just drowned. Um, exploring. What's Karen's PP look like for Thunderbolt? One. Good. Good thing I checked. Because if I got into a fight with that, that would be awful. Yay! Alright. PP restored. I wonder if... I can't remember if you ha if you can buy those or not. And I'm just going to wait for him. I love swimming. How about... What about you? Eh, sure. 
Like, part of me really likes swimming, but then there's, like, this other part of me that's like, eh, I don't really want to go swimming, like, ever. It's just like a... I don't know, it's just a whole... I like water, but I don't like being wet kind of thing. Which makes no sense. Which kind of sounds like hydrophobia, but it's not. It's more of something else. And here's Poliwhirl, the evolved form of Poliwag. Which I also just destroyed. Because I was going through my memory banks, but... If I've talked about it, which we have not seen it, so whatever. But it's fine, it's just a strong version of Poliwag, not much more to say about it. Level 5 tentacle, seriously, I, every t if, I, if I only find level 5s, I'm just going to run from it, because there's literally no point in fighting. Ooh, double battle. Who's in my second slot? Because if it's Xavier, that's really not a good thing. Uh, switch with Jack. Yes. I'm looking after my brother. He just became a trainer. What I don't... The one thing I don't get about things in the Pokemon world, it's like, you have to be at least 10 years old to be a Pokemon, become a Pokemon trainer. But you have, like, these little kids that are already Pokemon trainers with level 30 po like, level 30 plus Pokemon. It's like... I... It's like... I don't understand. Why? <laughs> Is it like in some areas, it's just like... No, you can become a trainer whenever you want. But then in Palette, it's just like... Because you're from Palette, you have... You are forced to wait until you're 10. Because... Reasons. I don't know. It's just weird. But with that, Goldie and Seeking have been defeated. Jack gets a lot of experience because of the EXP share. That's no way to treat my little brother. Yeah, but I don't really care much for your little brother, dude. My big sis is strong and nice. I think she's awesome. Well, he doesn't seem to have any quarrels about it, so... Moving right along. Wow, it looks like a cult down there. Hello. Oh, well. Of all the trainers, and I get caught up by a 26 tentacle. See, that's worth. That's something worth fighting. If I didn't have to. Wait, I should heal. I should heal. Nope. <laughs> I should heal before they catch me. Jeez. And I should probably buy some other types of potions, but whatever. Some someone catch me. Hello? Oh, do I have to talk to you? Okay, well. I think they're blind or something, because I was literally right in front of her. Oh well. I'm getting like really tempted to just speed this up because this is getting to be a, a little bit ridiculous with all these battles but I also don't want to skip them so after this fight I'm just gonna fast forward I guess even though when I fast forward I don't know Microsoft uh, or yeah no Windows Movie Maker glitches up, but whatever. So, yeah. And there's that. So I'm going to speed up now. So I'll see you guys in a couple minutes.
Oh, here's something new. It's a tentacruel, the evolved form of tentacle. It's a bigger, stronger version of tentacle. There's really not much to say about it. It's probably a little stronger, but really it's not a threat. It's not a threat to you, me, or anyone else. Unless it's in the anime where there was a giant tentacruel, but even still, still not that threatening. Okay, carry on. So you know what, I'm just gonna f fight these people off screen. I don't really feel like fighting the rest of the, the rest of them. Oh, actually, this isn't too bad. Uh, Seafoam Island. Oh, crap. I forgot this place existed. I think, I, th you know what guys, now I think about it, Seafoam Islands. My least favorite place in Pokemon. I know I said my least favorite place was, uh... Was, uh, Silphico? No. No, Seafoam Islands takes the cake. So, I'm gonna... Finish fighting everyone you saw on the way here. This junior trainer. And this swimmer over here. And when I come back, we're gonna go through Seafoam Islands. Thank you all for watching. I've been Dark Young Link. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.